How is she? Your good lady wife. She called in sick uh, again. Long time for a stomach bug now. Um, well, yeah, she had a dodgy kebab. I told her not to have it. Not a headache, then. Honestly, you're a worse liar than she is. It's all right. She's not on the naughty step. I just want to help. That's you all over. So come on, then. What's been going on? I tried taking her to the pub yesterday, only I weren't here. And she overheard Layla slagging her off, and now she thinks all her mates think the worst of it. Well, not all. Lydia's proven herself to me. Touching is that. Why don't I go up there? Talk to her. Would you? Hmm? I don't reckon she'd really like that. <laughs> She's playing games. I think she's just trying to be nice. Hmm. I'm not so sure about that. Something's not right. I knew it. Letting folk down, you know that. So, uh, how's the headache now? Still crippling, is it? So that's why you're here. Nice, isn't it? Mm. Can't have a few days off sick without someone coming and checking up on you. Define few. So sue me. Do you know what? Yeah, actually, I'm not ill. I pulled a sickie. Hardly crime of the century, is it, when you compare it to some of the stunts you've pulled? <laughs> well, that's me told. You can sit down, you know. You won't catch anything. Right. <clears throat> What's that smell? Dog or puberty, take your pick. Bit different to your place, I know, but not everyone can afford saffron candles in their bog. I meant the meal. But if this is what you have to do to make yourself feel better... I don't know what you mean. The cutty remarks. Playing me for the day. I'm nothing like you. So why pretend? Who's pretending? Everyone seems to think I'm a hard-faced cow with no morals, so I might as well prove them right. <laughs> I'm really glad I came for this visit. You know, you acting like this, it's about as absurd as me cooking a rabbit stew. Or cleaning out that... Is it a penware pig slip? You know, making me smile don't change anything. Layla still thinks I'm capable of robbing old people of the life savings. And as for the rest of the village, well, I'm sure tongues are wagging. So let them. More fool them. And all the more delicious when you're proven innocent. I'm sure you doubt me as much as they do. <laughs> if you're guilty, I'm booking myself in a sanatorium. <laughs> Thank you. You know, people can surprise you sometimes. Well, not in your case. Well, other than today... <sighs> Can I not get you a drink? I'm guessing you're running low on chamomile. Oh, Sam had the last bag this morning. Hmm. Then we'll have to do this tomorrow. At mine. Ten o'clock sharp. 